Hello there kids, it is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming to you with another episode of The Shadows of Mordor. Alright, and when we left off, I was, uh, <laughs> I wasn't as sick as I was the first time, and now we're going to do a little bit of, uh, memento picking up, kind of. Uh, that I was working my way towards this, so I figured I might as well grab it while I'm here. Frolum's Ring. This ring was given to the unhappy bandit Frolem by his beloved wife as a symbol of their undying love. It was violently pulled from Frolem's hand along with his index figure, finger Ugh, I can't talk anymore. After his capture by the Dark Lord Sauron's minions, Sauron would use this ring to torment Frolem into betraying his comrades. Oh, there's a memory point somewhere. Oh, it's right there. Who's this now? Some unhappy bandit named Forlun or Gorfab or something. He was screaming for his wife. <laughs> the boys laid into him a bit. Or in a bit. He dead? Nah. The boys know the big man powerful living and wants a word. His sack of dung might know where his thief powers are hiding. Strip him down. Take the ring, too, and give it to the boss. He likes that stuff, and when he wakes up... Oh, boy. Sounds like they looted him after they knocked him around quite a bit. That doesn't seem fun. Ugh. Okay. Now, what I was also moving us for... This world will not desecrate. For them, beauty exists only to be destroyed. Kinda, yeah, you're not wrong. Alright. There are a bunch of little things going on over there. Oh, not little. They are pretty big. There we go. And, come on. There we go. Killed that one. Just to try and help out my people. A little bit. And, there we go. Didn't exactly go the way I planned it, but it worked. There we go. Down I go. I was going to go... Not that one. Oh, there's a new mission. Apparently avenging the death of the Seaward by killing Kuga the Bloody. I'll eventually get to that, but this first uh, kind of requires my attention. This little thing here. There's another thing over that away that I could also do, but that one is not what I'm currently focused on. I'm currently focused on... P. Ah. Pigug the Bloody. Well, he definitely lives up to his name with that face. Okay. Let's see what we got. Uh, invulnerable to stealth and ranged. Hate of Grogs. Fear of Karagors, but damaged by combat finishers. Um, I could try and... I could try and brand him... I'm going to see if I could do that. I'm wondering. Stealth brand. Maybe that'll work. Oh, weak. even that doesn't work. Okay. I gotta wait until I Give knock him down. I need that blood. I could tell. Okay. Let's knock him around a bit because that's all I can do. Maybe if I do this. Oh, no, that didn't work. Wanted this one. There, that didn't work. Shit, fuck, okay. Well, I tried. Ow, oh, jeez. Ow. How'd that work? Come on. Whoop, jeez. Okay, I forgot his thing inspires him to attack simultaneously. So that's gonna be a problem. Oh, jeez, yeah, I am outnumbered all right. Oh, jeez. Okay. There we go. Now I've been getting some headway. Jeez. There we go. Stop. Jeez, okay. Drain. There we go. There we go. Get some health this way. Helps in my favor. Oh, jeez. Okay. Oh! No! I didn't want to kill him! Damn it, guys! I wanted to have him join us. Damn it! Oh, well. There we go. I'll have him join us. There we go. Oh, really? Well... <laughs> now they're chasing after him. Okay, well that didn't go exactly as planned, but hey. I'll, I'll take it. Okay, broken mine. Four elf shot on a drain or brand. 
Hmm. It's not necessarily going to be useful, I think. Uh, yeah, I'm not really convinced that that will actually help me. So... Yeah, you know what? I'm just going to break that down. Break that down. There we go. Perfect. My head's just a little low. I'm going to turn it up back a little bit. There we go. I'm going to head over here. Because there's a couple people in this direction I kind of want to deal with. Uh, mainly to capture them into my little fold of Uruk uh, followers. For lack of a better phrase. I like to say Uruk army, but at the same time, it's kind of redundant to say that because they're going to be an army soon enough. Um, these two uh, is involved right here. Uh, Mosfell Hide Skinner. I wanted to double check his weaknesses real quick. He's vulnerable to combat finishers. He is most likely a kill. We don't need to keep this guy around. So Mosfell, we can kill no problem. Well, that's not who I wanted to look at. Uh, it's unfortunate that he died. I kind of wanted to have him join us, because he was pretty strong, but sometimes it doesn't work out that way. Uh, the guy who I wanted, uh, I'm pretty sure this was the guy ambushing or getting ambushed, Narug, uh, going after the other guy, Mosfell. This guy also has a lot of strengths. Not a lot of weaknesses, and in fact, I might have him join us if I can stealth brand him. It looks like he is vulnerable to stealth finishers, so uh, a stealth brand might actually be in my favor here. So I'm thinking if he's the one getting ambushed, I'll try to stealth on him. And if he's the one getting ambushed, I'll wait until uh, the other guy comes out, kill him, and then go after him to brand him. The other guy. You, you, you know what I meant. That It made sense when I was talking. <laughs> when I tried to explain it, not so much. Okay, onward we go. Okay, who's the one getting ambushed? That's the important I question. I need to stab something. Whose turn is it to be stabbed? Uh, apparently, uh, these guys. So he is the one being ambushed. That's what I expected. That that's also a name, Narug the Friendly. That's kind of why I want to have him with us because it's like a misnomer, but also on my team. That would be amazing, I think. All right, these guys are having some fun. Oh, I should capture this guy. I should capture this guy right now. If I can get him to move, Talion. There we go. There we go. Okay. Okay, there we go. Let's go down to this way. There we go. Over here. And stealth drain this guy. There we go. That way we have an archer given in this situation. Up we go. Okay. Whoops. Jesus. I fucked that up. I did not mean for that. Run. Run. I want Narug to show his face first before I start getting into any fighting. Okay. Well, he's he's looking like he's going to die before that happens. That's not a good It's not a good thing. There we go. Okay. Maybe I should help out a little bit. Okay. Uh take care of this guy maybe. There we go. Uh, Do you like my there he is. surprise attack, sweet? Uh, I find it funny that you're doing the surprise attack when Dance, you're the one who's Dance. weak Can against you scream louder stealth. Than at Uruk, I wonder? There's one way to find out. Great, you figured oh. me out, which makes it harder for me to figure this guy out. Damn it! I want to stealth brand him. Damn it! Let me go to stealth brand him. That's all I want right now. Okay, come on. Okay. Okay, there we go. That didn't work. Okay, Jesus. Come on. My boy! Damn it! Your boy. We don't have to fight. I'm not like them other orcs. Oh god. 
Okay, that fucking statement is giving me flashes of fucking 2007. Oh god. Ow, that hurt. That hurt a lot. Okay. There we go. Ow. That did not feel good. Ow, again. Not good. Okay. I hate of defeat, huh? That, that's fair enough. That's kind of where I was hoping to get him. Okay. Come on. Damn it. Wait on him. Oh, jeez. That, that does not help me. Oh, jeez. Okay. Problems. Problems have arisen in this whole plan. Uh, step. There we go. And you're dead. Good. That was almost bad. Oh, jeez. Jesus. Okay. Okay. Oh, well, you're gone. That was what I was hoping for. Not necessarily the way I wanted it, but that's fine. Ambush resolved. <laughs> See, it was a good idea to get that archer after all. He saved my ass. <laughs> oh, jeez. Okay. Okay. Oh, jeez. Again. Okay. Oh. Stop. I hit the wrong button. Oh, jeez. I'd say I hit the wrong button. Pain, but you're dying too fast. Yeah, yeah, I can tell. Yeah, yeah, I am. Ah, oh, jeez. I got too cocky. I got too cocky, and problems arose. Jeez. So, Kugrish got killed. Okay. Whoa. Lorm Manstalker. That's a fucking thing. His power increased. His power increased. Well, some I'm winning, <laughs> at least. While I'm losing. He gets pro I at least helped him. Humgrat Bone Crusher. Promoted. Okay. Tumug Giggles. I, I, I kind of want to face him next. Just because I want to see what the hell that name's about. Ishmaz. One of my guys. Huh. I didn't think that'd be a thing. So one of the captains ended up being promoted from a force that I control. Huh. So... That's something that I didn't expect. That's new. And I like it. <laughs> okay. That is something I like. Now, Lore Manstalker. I don't know his weaknesses. Don't know this guy's weaknesses. This guy's new. So now I gotta Marwin was learn them. That wizard was using her to get to you. Yeah. Using her to build an army within Mordor. Sauron yep. and Saruman both Which now we can still do ourselves. Maker. There can be only one Lord of the Rings. Ah. Uh, what what the Shaka. Shaka Ghoul Slayer. That close to me. Hmm. There's a thing. Unfortunately, he's not powerful enough for me to justify joining or having him join me, rather. So I could just kill him off. Which I could Easily start with that. Knock him around a little bit. Come on, buddy. You are very, very bad. There we go. That was quick. You should not have been without your team. Blade Master. Uh, do I have a higher Blade Master than that? I do not. I have 18% chance to recover health on any kill. I had a higher level one than that. Okay, well then, we'll break that down then. Although that percent chance is still pretty low. But, I mean, at the same time, it's on any kill. So, eh, it's useful in its own right. Okay, up we go. Really? Is that what you're trying to say? Huh? Okay, I'm going to get up here and get this memento. Because apparently that's all I seem to be good at today. What do we got? Gondorian coin. Merchants across Middle-earth know it's, if it's Gondorian, it's good. 
and they freely accept these silver pieces, known as castar, as currency, trading them across the civilized realms and with almost all the races of Middle-earth. This particular coin likely made its way into Mordor through that realm's primary trade route, the Sea of Nurnan. Okay, and there's the little memory point. It's good, a coin of the realm. Sure, but it's the coin of Gondor's realm. If you don't want it... I didn't say that, Captain. But how about a few less of these and a little more of that elvish cloth you brought over from Eregion? I, I think we can do that. Alrighty. That sounds like a decent trade to me. <laughs> okay. Oh, I've earned an upgrade. I don't know how. Oh, I've made enough attribute points. That's what it is. Uh, I can open up another rune slot. Hmm. Do I want to do that, or do I want to save up the health? Uh-oh, my batteries are dying. Oh, no! Uh, <laughs> I kind of want to wait until I get the health, and then I can go for the rune. Yeah, I think I'll do that. I'll do it that way, then. All right. Well, what do we got? Save Gondor. Uruk do not care for trinkets. Sauron nope. will use gold to buy allies among the kingdoms of men. Yeah, that's true. And that's all he needs to do. Men are easily bought. Yeah, I know that much. Okay. <laughs> Need to wait for the chance I can go after this intel guy. Need to see how the landscape is. Uh... It's a straight drop, and he's going along the cave, or the cliff line, rather. So, kill him, kill him, and go after him. Hey, buddy, you are now mine. Thank you for joining me. Now I need to learn your information about Lorm Manstalker. What about this motherfucker? Wow, he has a lot of knives on him. Shit. <laughs> uh, he's also vulnerable to ranged attacks, vulnerable to mounted beasts. Summoner, Wraith, Stunblock. Hmm. Tracker. So I wouldn't be able to get away from him should I try to hide. But I wouldn't try to do that. Is there a way I can make him stronger? I wonder. Just influence him from the sidelines. And then... Yeah, I'll just mess this guy. And then maybe make him stronger, see what he learns from all of that. Okay, I need to shake the rust off. Let me deal with these guys a little bit. Shake off the rust. Hey, buddy. You need to get knocked around a bit. There we go. Beautiful. Get this guy. Beautiful. All right. There we go. Up, up, that. Nice ride. You tried very hard, though. I'll give you that much. Okay. Oh, this guy ended up getting caught on fire. <laughs> That's funny. And he died. How about that? Whoop, oops. I didn't mean to do that. It worked out, kind of, though. Well, not really. There's a guy who apparently survived. Oh. Oh, you noticed that, did you? Okay, well, oh, there's that. There we go. All right, well, hey, buddy. Do you hear that? Oh, that's brand new. Fuck it. There we go. And goodbye. There we go. I think I shook. I shook enough of the rust off. I think. I think. Key phrase. All right. There's an intel guy over here. There's also an intel guy behind me. I'd rather go for the easier one. Which is behind me. Alright. And... Oh, it's not a guy at all. It's just intel laying on top of... A pile of grog? Eh, either way. Works just fine. What do we got? Okay. About the unknown captain. Gom the Trainer. That's a name. Eager to fight Talion and show other Uruks how it's done. Well, good luck with that, buddy. Uh, fear of grogs, fear of betrayal, and damaged by combat finishers. And he's pretty weak, to be perfectly honest. He's pretty weak. But then again, I've been beaten a number of times by Uruk Captain, so 
Of course, they're going to show me the weaklings, so that way I can rebuild myself up to a formidable force. Okay, um... I might go after this guy, Hoshgrish. Who's Hoshgrish? I forget. I want to double check who that is. Hoshgrish... Uh, uh, that guy. There it goes. Hushgrish the Strong. Who is a misnomer because he's damaged by combat finishers and stealth finishers, which are the easy things I can do. Uh, hate of more guy flies, sneaky, and grapple. <laughs> I could easily take on that guy, kill him off. In fact, I can easily do that right... Well, next episode. <laughs> I'll do it next episode. How's that sound, huh? For now, I'm going to end this one. Thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. Click the like button if you like this particular video. And share and comment so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about how bad I am at doing some of the things that I really want to do. Like that little plan of mine that went fucking ass up real quick. Or tits up, technically. I'm more of an ass guy anyway. I will see you all in the next episode. This has been the one and only Stray Cat playing games, fucking up my own outro for goofy shit, because why not? And... Fucking playing games. <laughs> I fucked up my outro really bad this time. Jesus, Howard Christ. For you.